in the quiet embrace of the Atlantic, where the salty breeze danced with the whispers of ancient legends, Oak Island stood as a silent guardian of mysteries waiting to be unraveled. Its story began like many great adventures do, with a sense of wonder and a touch of serendipity. Picture a time when the world was vast and unexplored, a time when the lure of the unknown hung heavy in the air. It was in this enchanting backdrop during the late 18th century that a young lad named Daniel McGuinness set foot on the island's shores. Little did he know that his innocent curiosity would spark a saga that would echo through the corridors of time. One fateful day, as he roamed the island's rugged terrain, McGuinness noticed an odd depression in the earth, as if nature herself had carved a puzzle into the very soil. Intrigued, McGuinness gathered his friends, and with hearts pounding with excitement, they began to unearth the enigma hidden beneath the surface. The earth, moist and fragrant, yielded not just dirt but fragments of history. Their shovels struck something solid, igniting their hopes. What followed was a relentless pursuit, a series of digs that revealed layers of cryptic signs, a stone here, a piece of pottery there, all leading to a treasure tantalizingly out of reach. News of their quest spread like wildfire, drawing the attention of scholars, adventurers, and dreamers from distant lands. Oak Island, once a speck in the vastness of the Atlantic, became a beacon of mystery, its name whispered in awe across continents. The island's allure was undeniable. It was a siren's call to those who dared to dream and a challenge to the brave at heart. The island itself seemed to come alive with the spirit of exploration. Every rustle of leaves and every gust of wind carried with it the echoes of ancient civilizations and the tantalizing glint of hidden riches. The very ground trembled with the footsteps of countless treasure hunters, each one adding a new chapter to Oak Island's ever-growing legend. As the years passed, the island became a tapestry woven with the threads of human endeavor and unyielding determination. The hunt for the treasure turned into a sophisticated endeavor, with engineers, archaeologists, and historians joining the quest. Ingenious contraptions were devised, and the earth beneath Oak Island was mapped with meticulous precision. The treasures unearthed were not merely gold and artifacts, they were pieces of a puzzle that hinted at a grander design, a design that had eluded explorers for generations. The story of Oak Island's treasure hunt dates back to the late 18th century, when young Daniel McGuinness, while wandering the island, stumbled upon a peculiar depression in the ground. Fueled by curiosity, McGuinness and his friends initiated a dig that would set the stage for one of the most enduring mysteries in history. As they dug deeper, layers of secrecy began to unfold, revealing a series of intricate booby traps, underground tunnels, and enigmatic inscriptions, all seemingly guarding an unimaginable treasure. The transformation of Oak Island from a secluded haven to a bustling hub of exploration and tourism stands as a testament to the enduring power of human curiosity and the magic of discovery. With every passing year, the allure of the island has only grown stronger, drawing intrepid souls from every corner of the globe. In the annals of history, Oak Island has become a living legend, a story whispered among generations, igniting the flames of imagination. The fragments of pottery, coins, and ancient symbols etched into stones have not just been relics, they have been keys that unlock the doors to the island's past. Each discovery, no matter how small, has added a new layer to the mystique, beckoning enthusiasts to dig deeper, both metaphorically and literally. What was once a quiet pursuit of treasure has now become a vibrant tapestry of human endeavor. Oak Island has welcomed the world with open arms, becoming a sanctuary for the curious minds and an inspiration for the ardent dreamers. The island's shores, once untouched by the footsteps of outsiders, now bear witness to a constant influx of visitors, each one adding their own chapter to the island's saga. The emergence of guided tours has transformed the island into an outdoor classroom, where history comes alive. Enthusiastic guides, armed with knowledge passed down through generations, lead groups of wide-eyed tourists through the very sites where history was unearthed. The air is charged with anticipation as visitors trace the footsteps of the ancient explorers, feeling the pulse of the island beneath their feet. Every artifact, every inscription, becomes a bridge to the past, 
connecting the present generation to the enigmatic souls who once roamed these shores. Local businesses, once modest and unassuming, have blossomed into vibrant enterprises, fueled by the passion of the island's visitors. Oak Island-themed souvenirs, from intricately designed trinkets to detailed maps, have found their way into the hands of eager collectors worldwide. The island's legacy is now proudly displayed on shelves and mantelpieces across continents, a testament to the enduring appeal of the mysterious tale. The heart of Oak Island beats not just with the promise of material wealth, but with the shared stories, the friendships forged, and the unquenchable thirst for knowledge. As the sun sets in hues of amber and gold, painting the waves with a mesmerizing glow, it encapsulates not just the end of the day, but the culmination of countless dreams and aspirations. Oak Island has become a sanctuary for dreamers, a sanctuary where the boundaries of reality blur and the line between history and myth dissolves. It stands as a living reminder that the pursuit of the unknown is not merely a quest for riches, but a celebration of the human spirit. The treasure that Oak Island offers is not just buried beneath its surface. It is woven into the very fabric of its existence, waiting to be discovered by those who dare to seek and in the process, a, discovering something profound within themselves.